We have a guest today. Say hello to Steven. Hello. <laughs> LA is a total hole. It's a dump, but there are some good things. We're gonna show Steven around at some things to do in Los Angeles that don't suck. I've been having a blast. I, I love it here. It's a lot of fun. <laughs> Steven, you're ruining the entire message of my tape. But listen to Greg. Thank you. And in several weeks in the future, we have Anne's parents, who we're also going to show around. So come along with us as we show you things to do in LA that don't suck. One thing that's a must on my list is going to the Venice Boardwalk at night. Come on, let's go check it out. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what do you smell, Anne? Straight urine. Urine. It's just been sitting there. Ah, I love the smell of pee. Am I supposed to say something? No. The Venice Boardwalk features some of the finest homes in Los Angeles. Crafted with ingenuity and love and passion. And you can see it, it shows. I enjoy bringing people out here because I just love seeing the, the joy on their face as they see such splendor. Yes, this is not a pretty sight. <laughs> what do you think, Heidi, beautiful? Beautiful. Our homeless friends have parked themselves right onto the beach. They can't We're gonna go to Abbot Kinney, world famous street named after the founder of Venice, California. Very trendy, lots of shops. They have an ice cream place called Salt and Straw, which is based out of Portland. They have a donut place called, I don't remember, based out of Portland. There's a lot of great Portland snacks here. Extra small on the top. Okay, I'm gonna pull an extra small from the back. Okay, Anne's gonna try on some bathing suits here. Go ahead, okay, Anne. Stop it. Look at how pretty this color is. It is very cute. Oh, very cute. And we got matching underwear. Oh my god. Oh, that would be fun. <laughs> We're here at Pudu Pudu eating some pudding. You should get two different kinds. Two? Yeah. Like half chocolate, half strawberry, please. This is great design here. I love it. What do you think, Ann? It's good. I think it's delicious. Yummy. It's got a very smooth texture. Weeks into the future, we liked Pudu Pudu so much that we came back with Tim and Heidi. Today we will be celebrating the birth of our nation with America-themed pudding. Are we going to eat the pudding or are we just going to admire it for a little bit? Voodoo amazing! <laughs> Gotta get it all! <laughs> An absolute must is the Griffith Observatory. It used to be that you can go up there and park, but nowadays you have to take a bus. So we're here, we're gonna ride the bus, and we're gonna go check out the planetarium. The museum inside the planetarium is very nice and boomer friendly. But while you're there, you must see a star show. They are incredible. You gonna see the stars? Mm -hmm. Sadly, they are very strict about filming, so I could not show you any of it. Welcome to the Ocean Planetarium and What do you think of the star show? Beautiful. Love the music and Would you gorgeous. recommend it? Mm-hmm. For sure. In addition to the planetarium, the Griffith Observatory offers some of the best views of the city in the city. Another great place to take someone is Sawtell. Sawtell is an Asian neighborhood 
Japanese restaurants, Korean restaurants, a lot of delicious food, a lot of great desserts. Look at all this candy. Pineapple. I love your pineapple. You ready? Yes, I'm ready. Cherry blossom pop. And? It's really good. Anne's over here looking for a bathing suit again. She just can't stop. Take off your shoes. Right here. Are you sitting on the floor? We're here at Furai Bowl and we're sitting on the floor, just like in Japan. Look at Anne's beast over here. Time for dessert. We're getting some. What are we getting, Anne? What? What are we getting here? We're Steven, will you shut up for a minute? <laughs> <laughs> what are we getting, Anne? Cookies and cream. Cookies and cream, what? Crepe. Thank you. Wow. So cute. Oh, yeah. oh, that's the Nutella. Oh, it's a fish. <laughs> oh, what a savage. We came back to get some crepes with Tim and Heidi. Yay. Got it in my nose. So good. This is insane. Insane bad? Insanely good. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Oh, I, I have to take a pick. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's strawberry filled. Are these chocolate filled? No, these are strawberry. Mm -hmm. Vanilla. Buttery. <gasps> mm. Delicacy. I would highly recommend there are two presidential libraries, the Ronald Reagan Library, and today we are going to the Richard Nixon Library. It is a drive, but it's worth it. Look at those shoes. Here he is. His house is here, his childhood home. The helicopter where Nixon did his famous farewell salute is here. <laughs> Great. The Nixon Library has an exact replica of the East Room. We're in the East Room now, waiting for George Washington to speak. <laughs> Inside those little cabinets. We heard from George Washington, Abraham Lincoln. The State of the Union. We're watching a Civil War reenactment, and it's very loud. <laughs> oh, rest in peace. I think it was great, yeah. The actors are great. My fellow Americans, happy 4th of July. <laughs> a great day. Beautiful. They have an exact replica of the Oval Office here. And as I'm standing here, I'm realizing Anne would make a great president. Oh, thank you. Do you feel like you're in the Oval Office? Yeah. So what do you think, the Nixon Library? This was a really great way to spend Fourth of July. Love the history. Yeah, well worth taking in. Another activity you can do is there are plenty of actual good hiking trails in Los Angeles. We are here on Cistern Trail and we are going to hike to the old MASH set. This is a real treat for you boomers. Graffitied. Gotta go through hard obstacles. Can Steven make it? And has a cross. Here we go. Please fall. Please fall. Please fall. It was scary. I almost fell. That's it, we made it to the mesh site. Here's where they filmed it. 
Aquarius even. You ready for war, brother? Of course, you can't go wrong taking your guests to the beach. Any beach. One of California's marquee destinations. Make sure you have plenty of sunscreen. I think it's too much. Yeah, you just gotta really mix it in and, and take some and put it on your other arms and thin it out. Check it out. Huh? Looking pretty good, huh? Oh boy. I'm gonna run to the rocks. Anna's gonna time me. You tell me when to go, Ann. Three, two, and one, go. Woo! How did I do? 11 minutes and 30 seconds. That's really good. Well, I'm gonna have to look up, see how far that is. Yeah. I'm staying out of the sun to be safe. There they are, like Baywatch. Down the street from the Nixon Library is, of course, downtown Disney. Now, this is quite a drive from Los Angeles, and I wouldn't say it's on the top of my recommendations, but if you have time, it's free. So it's something you can spend some time doing. There's also Universal City Walk, which is very similar. Wow. Oh my gosh, that must be so That's a little small. We have to get a bigger one. Uh, you, you, the uh, thing in the front of your head. Huh? Yeah, good enough. <laughs> oh. Very cute. There's a salt and straw, just like an abotkini. Will Heidi be tempted? The line may be dissuading yeah. her choice here. Here at the Grand Californian Resort, Disneyland's nicest resort, you can sit by the fire and tell tales of old. Anne is sneaking into pools again. She just can't help herself. Well, she doesn't have her bathing suit. Too bad for her. Sorry, Anne. We're too poor. You're going to have to save your money. You're going to have to save up. Can't go in yet. Maybe in the future, but not today. Greg, you lied to us. You said we could break in. I never said such a thing. Yes, you did. Tim? Yes. Did I say that? I don't remember. Heidi got her ice cream after all. She is a determined warrior. Beyond words. Beyond words. <laughs> Scrape. One of a kind. Steven's trip has come to an end. Steven, what's your review? I would give it a uh, 9 out of 10. Only a 9? Maybe it. Uh, why, why not a 10? What, what was actually, a, a 10. I, I, I take it back. I give it a 10. Good. So the things you did, you would say they didn't suck, correct? Correct. It was all amazing. Well, next time. We'll see you later. Fools think I'm stuck in my tank all day long. But the truth is, I can go anywhere I want, at any time. I am not bound by time or space.